It's cell phone video that's been shared thousands of times online. The victim in blue attacked in broad daylight as onlookers watched. Dallas police say the transgender woman was involved in a minor car crash just before the assault. What you, what you do, my papa? A second video posted online claims to show what happened right after the crash. The victim is seen shouting and banging on one of the wrecked vehicles. Off camera, friends are branding it a hate crime. But other residents tell us they believe she incited the violence by provoking the crowd. And it just turns into a frenzy. It's just disgraceful. Needless violence. Leslie McMurray is an advocate for the transgender community. She says the video is hard to watch. It's disgusting. It makes me physically ill to see that sort of thing happen because I feel the terror of that victim being surrounded by people that are taunting you and threatening you with physical violence. There's really literally nothing you can do other than pray. As bystanders taunt and jeer, a group of women drags the victim into a car and to safety. Dallas Police Chief Renee Hall alerted Mayor Mike Rawlings to the investigation. The mayor issuing this statement saying in part, I am extremely angry about what appears to be mob violence against this woman. Those who did this do not represent how Dallasites feel about our thriving LGBTQ community. We will not stand for this kind of behavior.